So today we're going to be doing something pretty cool. Like Minecraft, I went back to the older versions. And since my viewership is mostly Terraria on this channel, I decided to go back to the older versions of Terraria before I even played Terraria. This is 2011 Relogic. <laughs> okay, this is 1.0.3. We have some other versions to go through as well. So if you guys want to know, like Minecraft, I played my Minecraft on the console edition just like Terraria. But I don't think, I think I started playing Terraria in 2015, so I want to say the console edition was pretty old. I want to say it was probably maybe in the 1.2 era of Terraria, so I, want to, I don't want to say it was too old, but I don't want to say it was too new as well. So 2015 console edition, I don't know what, what version it was, I want to say it was like 1.2 something. So let's just get into it, we need to create a character, this is insane. Like I can't even I can't even create. So um Tom I'm just gonna name myself Thomas and we're gonna accept and we are going to create the character. We're gonna go back and we're gonna go to Tom this is this is weird. The older versions of Terraria look like. I don't know personally because I mean I used to watch Terraria, so I I know what the furnaces look like. They look kinda weird. So cause re re you guys remember Tobuscus? Those that's the channel I used to watch. So, <laughs> I'm really excited to get into this. Oh my lord. This is insane. Okay, so is there a zoom? There is no zoom. Oh man, this is crazy. What about the map? Uh, is I don't think there's a map. Alright, so what do we got? We got a copper axe that does three damage. And the, remember when they didn't have no backdrops? Remember when it had no back- I, I do- okay, so I do remember when it didn't have no backdrops. So, what we're gonna do in this episode is we're going to do some ex a little bit of exploring. So look at the mushrooms! The mushrooms kind of look the same. Uh, you can tell the copper stuff doesn't look the same. There's a few textures that are a little bit different. And there's no backgrounds. So this world actually kind of reminds me of the tutorial edition on the Xbox 360 edition. Oh, the sounds are different too. The sounds are different. Ah! All right, let's go. Let's let's mine some of this copper up. Let's because copper looks really interesting here. What did the death animation look like? That's my main question. So I think we're in a softcore world. Okay, there you go. That that worked. So I kind of want to see what the death the death animation was so let's see if i can let's see if i can kill myself here it's just a video game it's for it's for purposes so what did the death so okay all right so let's see what we can do let's build a little house right here uh nice little terraria house so we don't have block swap of course so <laughs> we're gonna have to live with uh, live without that i can't build over grass i can't build over grass <laughs> wow Wow. Oh man, this this is a pretty slow. This is gonna be a pretty slow slow game here. I'm gonna build like a little house. Oh shoot, do we need the axe? Oh, we need the axe for the wood that we place. That's kind of crazy. I will say. I didn't know it used to be the axe. That's that's something I learned that I did not know it was the axe before the pickaxe. But it makes sense to use the axe on your wood, right? It seems like the those, by the way. Oh, look at that old workbench texture. How do you, how do you place, how do you place the, I feel like I'm learning Terraria again. Uh, oh, I don't think you could place stuff inside your inventory. You can't. All right, the door texture is insane. All right, all right, let's, let's place some of the doors here. Door texture kind of, uh, place kind of looks the same. Oh, nope, now it doesn't. I kind of like the old door texture. That is, that is cool. What is this? Is this wall? Yeah, the wall kind of looks funny. Oh, it doesn't do it. I have to click. Um, we have some sunflowers, but they don't make you run faster, uh, sadly. Of course, I don't know if there was any different biomes, so that's the one thing I kind of want to check right now. I want to check if there's different biomes in this game. So this is like me learning a new game all over again. And I don't even think there's biomes in there. So I don't really know when they added backgrounds. I don't know if there's an underworld in this game. I would literally go to a cheat world just to see if I could. Oh, is this the old corruption? This is cool. This is actually kind of cool to me. The old corruption has the old, the old underworld 
music. Now, the underworld music is only when a meteorite falls. Actually, when the meteorite falls, that's that's your uh, that's what you see, or this is the song that you'll be hearing. But I don't think this 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 version is very playable because I don't see any entities or anything. M maybe it's broken. I don't know. Um, but with that being said. Let's go to a different version of the game, a little bit newer, and see how it shapes up compared to this. So this is Terraria 1.1.1. The sun does indeed look different. The sun looks like the old version, but it does look like they made backgrounds, and this is 2011, of course. So I'm really excited to see, you know, what, what's different. Like, why is my cursor weirdly green? So there were backgrounds. There were backgrounds. Uh, I guess you start off with dirt. <laughs> this is basically like regu regular chair. Okay, so there is something wrong with the sound. I think this game is broken. Wow, that opening. I see. I see a wrath. That means there's wraths in this game. That means there's hard mode in this in, in 1.1. So Connor, what can I do with this wood? Actually, tell me what I can do with my wood, please. <laughs> I'm begging you. So the door texture did change. Um, I can make this, but you need iron bar. Of course, the iron texture of the iron bar is different. So yeah, as I said, I don't really know what the. Here, let me just let me. We'll we'll figure it out. Good news, everybody! I played Terraria when 1.1.1 came out. I actually started playing it during 1.0.9, but of course on the console edition. So it was old but new man Terraria has come a long way to be honest and i love this game no matter what i'll even try to get people into this game so here we are on version 1.2 on terraria it this is actually logic of 2013 so we skipped a year so since we already have the world created one two three let's let's check to see if it opens and see what like what you know what's the difference so the zoom is not as gone and we have the mini map so that means we have a map so the map is is the thing we have backgrounds i've noticed that but okay so some things did change so we do not have that door that changed i don't know how to get anything in this game okay so there is entities in this the guide is here it's obviously no happiness so I, you can't tell what's that uh, so let me go ahead and let's go ahead and take a look real quick. So this, this version of the game does kind of remind me of, of the ones that I kind of played, but I, I doubt it was the console. I doubt it. I doubt it was anything, but I do want to check to see what the, so here is the corruption. Do we have, oh, we got some ear of worlds. Oh, you could pick up your shurikens. Uh, now you, you can't do that no more. I didn't even know you could do that. I'm all expecting to see a corruptor because I'm so used to hard mode. I actually have a uh, master mode world that I've created. Um, I wonder if there was floating islands in this world, to be honest. Hey, look at it. our first slime that we see in one of these older versions. So that's something. And it looks like it's snowing a bit. So there's a snow biome over there. Maybe we'll go over there in a little bit. Let me, uh, let me make a, a furnace. Furnace has probably changed because the other textures have changed too. Like, I remember back then in older Terraria, making furnaces were, like, extremely, like, difficult. So let me, let me find the guide real quick. How do we make a furnace? So the furnace, so 24 and 3. So, it, I remember, I remember briefly that it was, it was probably a, a hundred torches? I can't remember. I, maybe I'm tripping. I don't know. So we all know this version of the game. This version's not that old. Okay. And we can make a freaking furnace. Let's go. Look at the furnace. The old furnace texture. It's so cool. <laughs> I don't know why I'm geeking out about this. This is... I am... I'm having a blast. This game is fun even in its old style. I hate that though. Like why can't I just like... Oh, there you go. It's left click. Normally all you have to do is hold press and hold. Alright, let's see if we can get the guide to spawn in here. I like the how it emits that light. It probably did that. It does that in the new new Terraria versions, I think. How do I... I can't... Oh, you can't place these back on walls. 
That's terrible. I hate that idea. All right. Look at this little nice little house right here. Doesn't it just look amazing? Look at the little furnace texture. I like the furnace texture actually. All right, who votes old furnace texture or new furnace texture? Because I like the old furnace texture, especially if you're gonna be making your old one. All right, that's I like this one. Which brings us to the current version of Terraria. Of course, <laughs> nothing beats the old versions, but look at how far this game has come. And if you grab this, if you grab this, it plays the old soundtrack of the game. I'm, I'm glad they kept that in because that brings all the OG Terraria players back to when they were young when they played it probably. I'm, I'm not gonna lie, people that play this game that have played it back in 2011 are probably a lot older now, of course. And, and, of, and, and of course, Zoom. We all know my old world. We all know the old world here. It's awesome. Oh yeah, that's right. I did like some modding onto this world because I'm done with this world. I'm, I'm done with this. I was done with this. So I did some a little bit of modding on here. We did some stuff. Just, just so much stuff in the game that we, we've gotten. It's just, it's, it's, it brings me back playing my old console edition when like things were a little bit broken. Things followed the PC, but there's, it's really cool to, to learn new things about how the older versions of the game worked. It was so awesome, to say the least. But New Terraria does add a lot of stuff. Like, we, it adds a lot of new NPCs, especially the golfer that I did not know we had. You know what I mean? New trees, new sounds, new, just new, new backgrounds, of course, and just a lot of new things that we haven't really had. The game is really interesting now, I will say the least. I will say, the game is interesting. I love the game. I, as I was saying before in the beginning of this... Anyways, we have cool secret biomes when you put all those things down. New soundtracks and stuff, and it's really cool. I had to really relearn this game, especially when it came to these pylons. I didn't even know what I was doing. I didn't know you could do this with the pylons. Go down. You can go down here really awesome. You can, you can go wherever you want. As long as it's not corrupted or your NPCs don't leave or die, then you can go wherever you want. But still, their happiness does play a game because you can even sell things for for a lot more when they're happy than you can. Look, I even have six platinum in this world. And, and no matter what, no matter how new the game is, no matter how people say that the older ter versions of Terraria are good, Terraria is just an amazing game no matter what and I'm glad that it came out and I'm glad that somebody designed it and I'm glad that I get to play it <laughs> that's all I have to say it's one of my favorite games with that being said thank you guys so much for watching this journey back to memory lane and I hope you guys played Terraria before on PC back in 2011 if you did to claim your badge right now right here you guys are, are a OG Terraria player I didn't start playing until Xbox 360 but I really did like enjoy this game it was something new and I loved there's so much stuff in the game I kept learning and learning I was like oh this is awesome there's like just so much stuff to do in this game and uh, yeah, if you guys liked it, maybe leave it a like and subscribe. Consider subscribing. I do things like this all the time. And as always, I'll see you guys in the next video. Peace.